How's it going, Reef Keepers? Just figured I would uh, go ahead and add a video to the Nano Tank build series and let you know that it's still chugging along, still going. I have until Christmas, so I'm not super stressed about it, but uh, I have the uh, uh, controller cabinet built for this project, and the controller cabinet was literally like a, you know, whatever, $75 Amazon stand special um, you know, Amazon bathroom cabinet stand thing and something you get for like a dorm room. It doesn't need to be anything special. Um, but, uh, it actually turned out to be pretty good quality. You never know with these kind of things. And this one turned out to be pretty solid. I'm painting it for my kid. Um, I, I'm no artist, so don't judge. It's not done. I got to put bubbles around the outside of it and all that. But, uh, as you can see, it came with a couple of shelves. I'm only going to use one. Um, but what I did, instead of putting on the like flimsy backer uh, that it came with, I actually took a piece of this plastic marine board. You can see it's about this thick. Um, and it's like this, this plasticky material. Apparently they use it on boats, um, ocean faring boats. But uh, I had a few sheets of it, it left over from another reef project. And I just drilled an ugly hole in the back of it to put cords through. And uh, I'm gonna create like a little controller cabinet area up in here. Um, and I've got like a, um, uh, I can't remember, an e-coral light controller that I'm gonna put in here, along with like, you know, the different, uh, the different control boxes for like the pump and that kind of thing. And then down below here, I'm actually doing like a, a miniature uh, Kelkwasser reactor. So I'll show you that in its own dedicated video when it's done. But uh, I think that'll look pretty cool. So um, I think it's about a foot deep um, and maybe 22 inches wide or something like that. But uh, it'll be positioned next to the tank and all the cords can kind of run through the back. I'll, I'll do some kind of cord hiding thing eventually. Um, and then as you can see over here, I've got various things coming in. I've got a little backup pump. I'll do a video on this. It's like an off-brand thing, but uh, it looks a lot like the new AI pumps. And it was like an absolute fraction of the cost. So I don't know if this is the company that AI is having pr uh, produce those new pumps for them. And they're just slapping their name on them. I know that's what's happening. I just don't know if, if this is the exact company. But anyway, kind of a cool bottom draw pump. Um, some, you know, protective boxes for the electrical. A couple of solid heaters. Um, you know, GFCI. So... Yeah, I mean, things are trickling in. It's starting to come together. And uh, yeah, got her controller cabinet set up for her new little Christmas tank. So we will keep chugging along. Just wanted to check in. If you are uh, enjoying the build series, please like and subscribe. Thanks.